get the dough I find her skill so her temper with our time signature period oh you do your medicine or something there and i'm like what i don't know where in performing and visual art do you get something that is not performing or visual the amount of people i will pass on my exams with flying colors in jesus name amen and then i call grandpa so me know him as Ibo. so i met sean paul Will Marshall, it will be Tommy Marshall, right? right Jean Marc Wigan. Um, he's really nice, so yeah, okay. And whoever wants to talk about oh, picture picture this, picture picture that, that's you. If you don't want to take a picture, that's you. That's not me. I would take my picture. Thank you very much. At the end of the day, I don't need to sell myself because God has already have my path made out for success. <laughs> I signed up for this school with the mindset of, of being here for four years to do the full degree program at this institution and just it being something that I am passionate about that I've studied and pursuing and if y'all don't know, the girl is pursuing to be an international artist so that's why I'm doing Bachelor of Music in performance so as i said a four-year program and i am learning how to perform and just building on my craft and improving my instrument which would be my voice if y'all do not know what and the Manly college of the visual and performing arts the one and only of its kind in the english speaking caribbean then what are you saying because at this point people be asking me um, what do you do? And I'm like, I go to college, and they're like, which college did I even say in the mountain? And they're like, oh, you do your medicine or something there? And I'm like, what? I don't know where in performing and visual art do you get something that is not performing or visual. You feel me? So for those who do know, make up this um, coming to a closure in the program that I'm doing, which is Fundamentals of Music. Fundamentals of Music Literacy in Performance. I would say that. If I'm not accurate, it teaches you the fundamentals and liter literacy skills that you need to know to set a basic, to set a strong foundation in moving to learn further things on your music knowledge. And it's really a program that I'm happy that I was put in. Here, that I have to do it FMLP, but that will just go straight to year one. But if you're not um, attaining the required knowledge for year one, then you have to do it. And I'm happy I did it because now I know so much that I did not know. I'm just gonna sight sing, sight read, but I'm just gonna sight read and sing. Okay, just, just gotta get the dough, find her skill, set her tempo with our time signature period. And I must also commend the teachers slash lecturers, that's what you call them now, that were placed to teach and program the students in this program because they helped to they help to let the knowledge understandable at that level so that you can move forward and further in your studies and as I said like the institution for putting this program in place because instead of sending us out to go get that knowledge and come back to the school to apply for year one they offer a program so they're saying hey you can still come do this program you pass it you can go to year one I will pass all my exams with flying colors in Jesus name Amen. A lot of things that oh my gosh guys, if I want to really get really into my experience experience. Just to give you a little summary, it was very interesting because I came into an environment that was surrounded with music and just me having a passion for what I'm doing and I just love that and it was interesting because I found out that you're not only going to be doing music, you're going to be doing some courses that are of the liberal arts. <laughs> So it's really an art school, but yeah, you do performing and you do visual arts as well. And then like, you know, you have people that you meet, mm -hmm. and um, people that come into your life and just really make it um, a joyful ride. And then you also have people that leave your life and 
you know you just have to not question why but just accept the fate to know that if it was meant to be it would have been it would have still been and you have people that are just jealous of you for no reason as i can see in a time like that i can see that there's a light that shines and glows in and outside of me and it's like them being in the darkness is just being blinded by my light and clearly when a light is too bright you're always trying to hide your eyes and just kind of get away from it and it's like because you can't avoid it you just complain so i don't let that face me and of course i cannot forget to mention the amount of people I was literally saying this to myself this morning when I was having my devotion. I was like, God, like, I grew up seeing these people, like, whether on the internet, whether on TV, whether it's local or international, you know. It, it just was surreal in the moment and to capture that moment and take pictures. And whoever wants to talk about, oh, picture, picture this, picture, picture that, that's you. If you don't want to take a picture, that's you. That's not me. I would take my picture. Thank you very much. At the end of the day, I don't need to sell myself. Because God has already had my path made out for success. So he puts my name in rooms that I have not even stepped foot into. He, he mentions my name to people that I have never came across. And even if they don't know my, my name, like my face is being brought up so i don't need to always be selling myself to be like making an incorrect connection thank god i already will work it out and i'm not saying that i should never ever do that but it's a heavenly father <laughs> you know i need to take i need to take care of that so i'm good i will insert pictures so first up is all right i'm just gonna call him randomly so i'm at sean paul we're Marshall. It'll be Tommy Marshall, right? But we know her as Tommy Chin. So I met Tessen Chin, but I accidentally deleted the picture, so that's sad. My name Virgo, Coffee, Chris Martin, Elaine. Hi guys, so I just came on here to say that most of these persons that you saw before that I've met was because of one man and obviously Heavenly Father, Abba Father, Eternal Father. Cause all of this and more to happen but in terms of earthly wise i'm referring to a man that i call grandpa some may know him as Abel, but formally he's known as michael Grandpa. he's the one that i was able to meet these people um, i just really want to shout him out because he has really been such a great person he still is you know but yeah big up yourself grandpa just so you know it's grandpa for me and mr cooper for y'all Okay, I also want to say that I met Jean-Marc Wigan. Um, he is actually, I don't know if you would say alumni, but he is a recent past graduate of the current institution that I attend, which is the Endomani College of the Visual and Performing Arts. So shout out to you, John, on making it and graduating and completing the full tenor, you know. He actually pursued the degree program that I'm currently going to pursue, so... Yes, and he's really nice, so yeah, okay. Back to the vid. I didn't get to like take pictures, but I saw Taurus Riley. He was at a concert um that we had. I saw Peter Phillips. I saw Bruce Collin. I saw Yandy Phillips. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I did not get to capture the moment. We will meet again. We will. I think that's it for now. But you know, we embrace you, and I'm really grateful because my experience at my college has been good for me. I have no problem with my college that is tremendously terrible for me. There are some things that need fixing, improvement, and even us as individuals. Well, probably not fixing, but you know, improvement, of course. But yeah, um, generally, like if I was supposed to recommend to anybody that loves arts, I just want to try it out, I would 10 out of 10. You have to have a positive mind for yourself and know what you want because I went in there and I had this high musical thing that you know singing and dancing and to be honest I did see the singing happening here and there and the instruments playing so I was still getting that high musical vibe to be honest. You go in there with a mindset that is wavering like you're not sure but you're just trying to figure it out. I would advise you to like know what you really want because when you hear people that are always going to have negativity or just you're gonna have negative people around when you hear them start talking bad about the school or just generally speaking negative it, it may affect you it didn't affect me because i still went to school and had a good experience 
but it, it may turn you off and make you like rethink why you're here or like why you're doing it or whatever but as i said like it's all about your mindset to be honest if you go about this mindset and you see the good in everything are you trying to then it will be less bad for you that's my experience summary but i would have to edit this so it's concise and not lengthy i have this friend that i met her and she's just a darling and a sweet gem to me so shout out to you jersey Ann. and i will not be mentioning anyone else i'm going to close out the video right now thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment share subscribe click the bell to be notified when it whenever i upload a new video follow me on all my socials that in the dv down below Take care, be safe. I love you guys, and I will see you guys in the next video. And then it's falling. <laughs> the rain is falling. Okay, bye guys.